Hello and welcome to the roundup of this week's edition of the Engineering News and Mining Weekly magazine, published on Friday 3 September 2021. In this week's cover article, Engineering News and Mining Weekly Senior Deputy Editor Rebecca Campbell highlights how South Africa's radio telescope success has stimulated international expansion investment. The South African Radio Astronomy Observatory has already awarded the contracts for the construction of the infrastructure required for the expansion of the country's world-leading Meerkat Radio Telescope Array. The engineering news features focus on the South African Capital Equipment Export Council, where local companies continue to export despite the poor local markets. The Southern Africa Institute of Welding, where a manufacturing company strives for gender parity for women and oil refineries, where a lighting manufacturer highlights the importance of adequate lighting in oil refineries. The Mining Weekly features focus on mineral and metal processing, smelting and refining, where new contracts are awarded to a local services provider, and mining in Zimbabwe, where a technology centre bridges the gap between technology and people. This week's business leader is Anish Misra, CEO of Sedibeng Iron Ore and MD of IMR South Africa. And as this week's cartoon shows, it's becoming clear that inadequate port efficiencies and infrastructure are placing South Africa's gateway to Africa status at risk. We hope you enjoy this week's edition of Crema Media's Engineering News and Mining Weekly, the magazine that offers you news about developments in the real economy. Happy reading and see you next time. 